So there's been a lot of confusion as to what the rules are for expecting mothers giving birth and just how long their partner or support person can stay with them for in the hospital. Yesterday, Health Minister Jenny McCarkos said that rules had been tightened because of the coronavirus crisis and their partner or support person could only stay with them for two hours after the baby had been born. She said this had to be done to strike a, a balance between compassion and safety. This is what she said yesterday. A woman is able to have her partner or support person with her for as long as is required uh, for the entire uh, uh, labour and birth uh, of the uh, newborn baby uh, and then their partner or support person is able to uh, be with them for uh, a two hour visit after the baby is born. Naturally, this was very alarming for pregnant women in Victoria to hear. It sparked a lot of backlash on Twitter. One journalist pointed out that Victorians were allowed to sit in a hair salon for up to five hours if they wanted to get their hair dyed, but a partner or support person would have to leave after two hours of a baby being born. Well, the Health Minister, Jenny McCarkos, hit back at criticism on Twitter yesterday, saying that's not what she meant. This is what she tweeted. The only thing that has changed is a pregnant woman giving birth can now have one visitor when before it was two. Her partner support person can stay for as long as they wish during labour and birth and after the baby is born. The two hour visit relates to the subsequent visits and is the same as what applied in the previous directions too. Now this clarification should bring some relief to pregnant women in Victoria and of course their partners but the opposition has criticised the government for just increasing the level of stress and confusion during what is what or is what already a very difficult time.